The red carpet was rolled out at Mountain Home Air Force Base on Monday for the arrival of the ACC Commander General Hawk Carlisle and Chief Master Sergeant Steve McDonald. They stayed on base for two days, visiting multiple shops and squadrons, listening to the latest innovations and achievements gunfighters have been up to. What I really liked about their visit was just how genuine that they seemed to be and, and interact with all the airmen on, on the base. They even made time to race down a slide at the kids' gym <laughs> and shoot off some rounds at the range. On Tuesday, General Carlisle held an all-call where he spoke about short manning issues, Mountain Home's incredible integration capabilities, and how impressed he was with the wing's combat readiness. He answered questions from the crowd and even responded to questions that were asked via text message. The crowd felt the importance of his remarks, and Airman Wallace was inspired to remain a part of the world's greatest Air Force. I wasn't really sure if I was actually going to stay in after my six-year contract was up, but definitely hearing and taking away from his past experiences, it's given me a little bit of different perspective, so I, I feel like that might help me to influence to actually stay in, which is what I know a lot of people don't do, especially in our career field. General Carlisle and Chief McDonald's visit reminded leaders and airmen how vital Mountain Home Air Force Base's combat readiness is for mission success. To me, it really highlighted how important our role is in the defense of our country. For Mountain Home Air Force Base, I'm Airman First Class, Chelsea Tadonio. <laughs>